Rick, it's a pleasure to be with you and your followers again at this lunchtime hour at the Heart of Mart Institution today. We had a potluck, a big potluck with plates and bowls and pans filled with all kinds of food. Some of my past favorites, some new stuff, some weird stuff too, but I ate every bit of it. My stomach is way filled. And at that time, in preparation, I get my Pepto-Bismol. Because we know when we overeat, when we keep putting it in and putting it in and putting it in, we are going to overload our system with the cramps, with the pains, and with the possibility of diarrhea, which really we need our Pepto for. As your chief cardiologist at the Heart of Art Institution in the domain of life coaching, often I try to share thoughts and opinions with people as we go through the daily buffets of life. Those buffets are filled with all kinds of things, and some of those things fall into the category of stressors. Stress is anything that we don't like, don't fit into our world, or provide inconveniences for us, and there are many, many, many on the buffet. As we go through the days and our heads are filled with those stressors, emotionally we become overfilled. Emotionally, we may have the cramps, the headaches, the pains, the aches, until, as in everybody functioning, it is going to spew forth, often in verbal ways, which we at the Heart of Mart Institute call emotional diarrhea. This is a very infectious, very, very rapidly transferring process. If I come to you, and I start in with verbiage of emotional diarrhea, probably you're going to respond back in your form of verbiage of emotional diarrhea, and the communications become very inhibited at that point. Some of the things in the garage sale collecting field is that we often hear we have too much of this, it's taking too much of our time, it's taking too much of our money, is doing this, is doing that to those around us. And they may come out of their frustrations, out of their concerns, out of their own inner desires, wanting to communicate, but it's not effective if it takes the form of emotional diarrhea. So if we're experiencing that from another person, we must protect ourselves. In addition, we must learn how to control the stress in our lives not to allow the content to overwhelm the emotional process and lead us into emotional diarrhea as we journey through the piles of life less travel.